it's a difficult subject for me, but I need to raise again my fear that um, unless Donald Trump is in, is uh, warned by the Secret Service with the backing of the U.S. Department of Justice not to continue <clears throat> to incite violence against President Biden and others, uh, that we may have, uh, you know, it, I, I hate to even mention these words here, but we may have a successful assassination attempt caused by Donald Trump. And um, it's, it's such a sensitive subject. On the other hand, not talking about it is even worse, I think. Uh, I've made this case before, but nothing has changed. Um, so let, let me take this step by step. First of all, uh, let's say it's a month ago, there, Donald Trump published an address for President Obama. Um, and then there was a January 6th defendant who was on the lam living out of his van who republished it, but the authorities couldn't find him because he was living out of his van. He went over to the address uh, and had a, as far as I understand it, it's like a, an assault rifle, which is certainly enough to carry out an assassination. Uh, and he went to the address. It, was, it wasn't a correct address, but it was right near, as I as we learn from the press, uh, you know, I get my information from the press. Right? And uh, so then the fellow was going to do an assassination of President Obama, with, having been enabled into doing it by President Trump publishing uh, what was close to President Obama's uh, address. And I think personally, I have a law degree from the University of Florida. I've studied uh, federal criminal law uh, fairly intensively, and um, I think that there could be an indictment of President Trump. Indeed, that's probably what they should do. Uh, indict him as a uh, co-conspirator along with that January 6th person who is now under arrest. That's really what they should do. Is I, I think, I'm thinking out loud, but they should tell him he has one of two children, but, but it gets worse though. And I'll, I'll come back to what I think they, what I hope that, the, you know, the secret service and the department of justice will do, uh, <clears throat> because it's worse because, um, far worse, really the incident in Utah, which is hardly an incident, it's a, almost an attempted assassination there of president Biden incited by Donald Trump because he, the fellow in Utah was, semi-threatening Alvin Bragg, the prosecutor in New York City, and Letitia James, the attorney general, who are the enemies of President Trump. Now, President Trump may have actually uh, blown the whistle on this Utah madman, uh, and so his n intent would be negated there, but it doesn't change the fact that <clears throat> had the fellow not gone on social media like the first one did, he, he republished the address that President Trump had published, former President Trump. And um, so we lucked out as a society and as people who support democracy, we lucked out. They put it on social media. Uh, assassins don't necessarily publish their plans in advance on social media, right? More likely that they won't do that and then unless the Secret Service has developed the ability to read minds or to have some kind of psychic power that we've never even heard exists anywhere, uh, then uh, we're in trouble, right? There's, I mean, you don't even want to talk about these subjects, right? But there's a ses successful assassination attempt. So I have been proposing, you know, that, but I'm, I, it's actually coming more crystal clear in my mind now I believe that they can arrest uh, Donald Trump for having posted Barack, President Obama's address uh, on presumably Truth Social, which then enabled the near assassination attempt by the January 6th fellow. Um, 
you know, take it from me, the guy, they could prosecute Donald Trump. And that, so what they should really should do is uh, the Secret Service with the backing of the U.S. Department of Justice should basically give Donald Trump two choices. Number one, stop his lies and incitement of violence against uh, all these people that are in the justice system or, or specifically against President Biden. Or two, they will arrest him and try him for having published President Obama's address uh, knowing there, there was a foreseeable risk that it would be used for an assassination attempt. You know? Let me tell you. You or, you or I do something like uh, what President Trump did, publish uh, a thing like that, uh, and then there's a, there's a follow-up, you know, where there's a near assassination attempt. Guess what? We're going to get uh, arrested. 